Yeah, all personally, I haven't a thing to say this oh, morning. Come on. Somebody's so got to say good morning. No, we don't. don't. Say we never go ahead. No, no, I'm not. No, no I'm no, sorry. No. Why don't we flip a coin? Have you well, got a coin? No, there? Why don't we just say, uh, see you tomorrow and quit? I mean, you know, that's well, <laughs> my ideal. Let's okay. go. Come on. <laughs> Why don't we say what's on the show? Because it's a topical, news-oriented, fast-paced show with a bunch of dull people <laughs> <Jesus>. this morning. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, start. They've got you on close-up. Go ahead. They got okay. me on close-up. It's your turn. We start off with a little lighter item, an interview with uh, graphologist Linda Pitney, who will be doing a quick analysis of our handwriting for us, shaky as it is. Yeah, our graffiti, maybe. Our film critic Jim Beveridge will be along to talk about the passing of an era. This week, MGM announced it was virtually getting out of the movie business, selling its foreign cinemas and dis distribution network. Jim's going to sum up for us the heyday of MGM when they had in their stable S more stars than any other movie company. Now you say, uh, here's Dennis. All right. Here's Dennis. <laughs> You're supposed to argue. Yeah, I don't want to do it. <laughs> <laughs> Who's doing the news this morning? Hand me the news, I'll do it. <laughs> I'm doing the news this morning, okay. 